Hey, welcome to Nisi's World. Today we're going to be cooking and, well, grilling and seasoning ribs. So here are the ribs. We have rib, rib eyes and New York strips, okay? So I've already washed and cleaned my meat. And now I'm going to get ready to season it. All right, so here are some of my seasonings. Larry seasoning salt. Mm -hmm. Black pepper. No, not a wet kind. A little onion powder. You gotta have your Weber's classic grill seasoning. And then we're gonna use some Grillmates steak seasoning. Okay, now this is how I season my meat. Don't judge. So, first I start off with my grill seasoning mm -hmm. put it all over that thing mm -hmm. and it's gonna, it's gonna relax mm -hmm. okay then I'm gonna do my steak seasoning mm -hmm. okay and I'm gonna get that one right there in the back that's not getting on top once I move the meat over, then I'm going to use a little bit of my onion powder. And it don't matter what kind of onion powder you use. I got this from Walmart. Okay. A little bit of black pepper. And it doesn't matter what order you do this in. And it's not a lot because I do add a little water. A little oil so I'm gonna let kind of wash this off now I go really really light on my um Larry's because it has actual salt in it so I don't put a whole lot of that because I don't want it to be salty okay all right so that's me seasoning the front side and I'm gonna flip everything over and season the back side Flip it over. Make sure we get some more seasoning in there before I flip it. Okay. And now we're gonna Some more of the classic seasoning, the grill seasoning. Nice, 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 nice. Okay. And then we're going to do some more steak seasoning. These steaks are going to be so juicy and so good. I'm going to season them earlier. I'm not going to put them in the cook later. I'm going to put them in the fridge. They're going to be nice and yummy and juicy. Okay. I'm going to flip these two over here. I promise you it's not too much seasoning once I add my oil and my water and I poke my little holes in to make sure the seasoning gets all the way through and tell you these are going to be some of the best steaks you ever had. Okay. Alright. I'm going to come back to you when I get my water and my oil. 